What up, what up, what up, Jupiter? I'm Kirsten Fisher, and as always, I have your news for Friday, March 5th, 2021. Join No Place for Hate. We are excited to have you join this incredible program created by the Anti-Defamation League. No Place for Hate seeks to improve schools everywhere by combating bias and hatred and finding long-term solutions for creating and maintaining a positive climate. The ultimate goal for No Place for Hate is to send a clear, unified message that all students have a place to belong. All No Place for Hate members will also need to add themselves to the Remind group by texting at JHS No Hate to 81010. We haven't had a Remind code in quite a while, and I kind of cut myself off from reading 81010, so I did it again. Members will also need to add themselves to the N to the JHS No Place for Hate Google Classroom. The code is S G X C E four K. We will also have our meetings through the Google Meet link in Google Classroom every first Tuesday of the month from four to five p.m. Boys lacrosse of varsity takes on Wellington High School at home on Monday, March 8th at 7 p.m. All tickets need to be purchased ahead of time, and you can go to GoFan to purchase tickets. The Young Libertarian Club, that's right, you heard me right, the Young Libertarian Club. The first meeting is room 4112 or in the Google Classroom meet on March 11th at 3 p.m., the Google Classroom code is U5MSJ4V. The John C. Gibba Students Leadership Carry Stamp Scholars Fund and Chamber Foundation Scholarship Awards are looking to receive applications from the many outstanding St. Jupiter seniors. The deadline is March 12th. The application and selection criteria can be found on the following link. National School Breakfast Week begins on Monday, and the theme is Score Big with School Breakfast. I don't know if the words were going to be right there as I did that, but, you know, maybe they will, maybe they won't. You won't know. Well, I won't know. You will. Kevin, know. what? They don't know. They're watching. Yeah, they do know, but I don't. So, anyways, come enjoy the cafe's great hospitality and delicious breakfast. And remember, breakfast is free for all students. Now, remember, we've done the math for it. Free breakfast, not free breakfast. Free, not free. Free is better than not free. Thank you. Can you smile and mean it like Haley? Are you as school spirited as Kirsten? Do you love hearing the sound of your own voice as much as me? Then we need you for the JHS News next year. See Miss Miller in the Media Center or email madeline.miller at palmbeachschools.org for an application so that you can steal my job. I thought I was stealing your job. Yeah, seriously, what? Kirsten, you already you have a job here. Someone else has to come to steal know, my you. job. Well, your job pays more. You know, someone someone like <laughs> me, someone beautiful, handsome, five foot four, something like that, someone like that to take over. <laughs> Are you interested in being part of the award-winning journalism program at Jupiter High? Do you love photography, graphic design, or writing? Do you enjoy participating in off-campus workshops and being part of a creative team? Do you want to build your high school resume for college? If so, email Mrs. Muncie for a yearbook or newspaper application. Both yearbook and newspaper are journalism honors classes. Applications are due Friday, March 26th. This is an extended deadline. Best Buddies will have a virtual meeting on Monday, March 8th. We will be making posters for the Friendship Walk. Look in the Best Buddies Google Classroom for the info on the posters. We will have a fundraiser on March 9th at Culver's. We will collect the posters there. Please support Best Buddies for our annual Friendship Walk slash drive on Saturday, April 24th at the ballpark of the Palm Beaches. You can register as a walker or support our team. Hope to see you there. SJ News, as you know, we are naming the portable soon, so stay tuned for more info. We'll be sending out a Google form shortly via email for you to vote, so look out for that. Mask of 2023 Design Contest. Wait, Class of 2023. You know, it's been, it's been a long week. Sometimes I don't know how to speak English. Class of 2023 Mask Design Contest. Pick up a white mask at the table set up in the courtyard near Guidance. Contest winners will be announced on March 23rd. All grade levels are encouraged to participate. One winner will be selected from each grade. Teachers are encouraged to join in on the fun. Gift certificates will be given out, and you can win a free lunch. 
SGA News. We are now accepting applications for the 2021-2022 school year. If you are a current 8th, 9th, or 10th grader, you can now apply to join SGA through the website. Completed applications, including teacher recommendations, are due to michael.dileonardo at palmbeachschools.org, or you can place everything in an envelope and drop it in the main office saying SGA Advisor by April 15th of this school year. Now you have been waiting. The key club word of the day, also known as names, potential names for my future children. The name for today, or I'm sorry, the word for today is... Pharaonic, adjective meaning impressively or overwhelmingly large, luxurious, etc. That's actually one of the better potential names that we've had over the past key club words of the day. And now, National Honor Society applicants, make sure to follow the directions on the application. All 10th and 11th graders with an unweighted GPA of 3.0 or higher are eligible. The application can be accessed in room 1155 on the NHS car outside the main office and on the JHS website. The applications are due Friday, March 26 by 2.45 p.m., not a.m., p.m. I've made that joke already. That's my bad. Any applications submitted outside of the time frame will not be processed. Ms. Sparks is available for questions in room 1155 during periods 1 through 6 and lunch. And now the moment you have been waiting for, that is right, we have the birthdays of the day. Happy birthday, Alexandra Briseno Otati, Amy Manzano, Ashley McCallum, Thomas McCluskey, Mateus Pontes, and last but not least, Jacob Tana Thomas. I hope you all have a very happy birthday. And that, my friends, is all the news we have for today. So make sure you do your homework, do your classic, pay attention to your teachers, pet your dog, cat, fish, or hedgehog, drink plenty of water, and last but certainly not least, have a great weekend. And don't worry, Jupiter. There will be another year of you having to hear my voice every morning.